Welcome, welcome, welcome to our special drive-through open house. I'm Dr. Nigel Channing, chairman of the Imagination Institute. <laughs> Sit down. Hello. On your tour, you'll see how the five human senses can help capture your imagination. Oh, no. Can I go too? Absolutely not. Uh, this is one of our discoveries, the figment of imagination. Yeah, I know all about the senses. There's sight, sound, <laughs> smell, <laughs> touch, coochie coochie go, and taste. <sighs> taste my chicken. Can I go? Please, please, please. No, I don't want you out of my sight. <laughs> out of sight? Okay. Come on, everybody. Here we go. Figment, you are not going to be able to talk. Our first stop is the sound. By testing your hearing with a series of tones. Left ear, right ear. Left, right. What? This is odd. And hello. Hello. Who is this? It's Figment. Figment? I thought I told you not to interfere. But you've got it wrong, Doc. It's not about listening with your ears. It's about listening with your imagination. Now I've completely lost my train of thought. No, you haven't. It's over here! All aboard! Next stop, imagination! For every sound, your ears are hearing. A thousand thoughts can start appearing. And each of us imagines different things from just a sound. Your mind has wings. Continuing now, if I may, in a calm, scientific, figment-free manner, the things we see with our eyes can control the eyes of the imagination. Uh, let's begin by using the eye chart to test your vision. Now, all together, if you would please read line three and hit it. With M-I-G-N-E-N-T, you can see things differently. <laughs> sure, you can see with your eyes, but imagine what you can see if you used your imagination. Follow the bouncing figment. One spark of light can light your fancy. Your mind sees more than what your eyes see. Your sense of sight can make your fancy fly. There's more to sight than meets the eye. I say imagination must be captured and controlled. Nuh uh, imagination works best when it's set free. <laughs> Just turn your imagination loose and anything can happen. Figment? Figment? Oh, he's gone. Our research shows that smells often trigger the imagination. Especially when pleasant, familiar smells come to play. Coming to play? <laughs> I love them! Figment, this is not a good time. It's always a good time to use your imagination. So let the good times roll! Woohoo! You win one cent! <laughs> I'm sorry, but after that big stink in the smell lab, I hesitate to send you into the touch and taste labs. Perhaps I should end my open house right here. Great idea! We'll go to my open house instead. It's much more fun. Right this way, everybody! What is going on? You're turning this entire open house upside down. Upside down? Now you're talking! That's the best idea you've had all day! With just the spark of inspiration, I made my house an innovation. Imagination really bounce around. <laughs> they sound tied up and upside down. Now, here's a real open house. Come on in. So free of it. Me. 
more than you can imagine. But Doc, it's exactly what I imagine. Imagination is the brain's open house! Oh, of course! Imagination is just turning your thinking upside down. Come on, it's time to get back to the Institute. I know a shortcut! works the best when it's set free. You said it, Doc. Imagination is a blast! 